Hey guys, so I am very excited because it is finally time for episode 8 of Create This Book. And as usual, it is long overdue. Of course, I have school to blame again, so sorry for the long wait. Thank you for being patient. Let's get started with the pages that we're going to do for today. Okay, so the first page I'm going to be doing is page 215, and it is Create a Different Drawing. Try drawing something you've never drawn before. Choose something random. Have fun with it. Um, I'm just gonna look around and find some sort of random object that I can't ever remember drawing before and draw it. I know not everybody is really into drawing and that's why most of the prompts, there are like different ways that you can go about it, but this is like a drawing prompt so even if you don't love drawing, it could be fun to just draw something really, really random. You don't have to like try to draw it super well or put a lot of detail into it. Just think of something random that's kind of strange to choose to draw just because it's so random. Let's see what I choose to draw now. And next I'm going to be doing page 218 which says create a colorless page. Decorate this page without using color. You guys know how much I dearly love using color so this will be a little bit challenging for me. I, I have done a couple pages that are like mostly black and white but then I, I add that little pop of color and just enough to make me happy. But this one can't have any color whatsoever so if you feel limited by this prompt don't because there's a lot you can do in black and white. You can do patterns or pencil drawings or pen doodles or write things. Yeah, let's try that now. And the next page that I'm going to be doing is a really easy page. It's one of those pages that you just kind of get done and it's fun and you don't really have to think about it too much. Um, it's page 51. It says, create a signature. Use these lines to practice your signature. Try to include some variation. Star the one you think is best. And then I have provided many lines here for you to sign on and for me to sign on. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna be signing my name a bunch of times and I suck at signatures and always have, but when I'm really, really bored, I try to figure out a way to make it look cool. I never have succeeded, it still sucks, but it's still kind of fun to mess around with. So, and I will decorate it a little bit, um, but there's not that much space to decorate, so it's gonna be, you know, kind of like a simple, easygoing page. Let's get on with that now. I've been looking forward to doing for a long time because I have this specific idea for it um, so I'm pretty excited to do this one. It's page 173 and it says create a dedication. Dedicate this page to something. Write about it, draw it, attach pictures of it here and then you just write I your name. Dedicate this page to subject of dedication. Basically you can do whatever you want on this page. You dedicate this page to anything in the entire world and however you want to do it. So 
Yeah, uh, you could take it like a serious route and dedicate it to a loved one or something like that, or you could be more fun and whimsical with it. Whatever you want to do, I am going to go the fun route because I'm shallow. <laughs> um, but yeah, let's get into this one right now. Okay, so the last page that I'm going to be doing is another really, really easy one. It's page 194 and it says, create timed decoration. Use a timer to decorate this page in exactly 10 minutes. No more, no less. So yeah, pretty self-explanatory. Set a timer for 10 minutes, start, decorate, and when the time runs out, you stop. Okay, so the point of this is really for people like me who like to spend a lot of time on each page and obsess over the details and get annoyed at mistakes because we all, we, we just need to chill. Because when you only have 10 minutes to do it, it's probably gonna be kind of messy or it's just not gonna be complete or you're gonna make a mistake, you're not gonna have time to fix it, something's gonna be missing, and you're just gonna have to deal with it because that's the way it is. And it's gonna be fun slash irritating. So um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and try that now. That's all the pages that I'm going to be doing, so let me go ahead and go through them and show you close-ups of all of them and talk about each one a little bit. So starting with the Sock Monkey page, yeah, I chose Sock Monkeys because I don't think I've ever drawn Sock Monkeys before. It's a really random item and at the same time they're really cute and I like them, so I was really happy that I came up with this idea just in time because I was about to do something really boring and then I was like, wait, Sock Monkeys. Yeah, and then the signature page, and yes, you can see that my signature really sucks. I told you it would. And then I decided to decorate it by using these little characters. Uh, I just came up with them on the spot. They're just like these little, I don't know, monsters or something. I don't know. They're like goofy looking little things that are popping out of all of the lines, and um, I just thought that that would be fun and cute. And then the background is just soft pastels, some like different colors of soft pastels to make it interesting and so yeah it's a pretty simple page it didn't take me very long at all but I think it's 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 okay it's like kind of cute the dedication page so I chose food because I like food but also I'm in this phase where I really like to draw food I don't know I just think it's really fun so I chose a couple different <sighs> Sorry, there's like, so yeah, I just drew pancakes and pizza and a s'more and a strawberry donut cupcake and a cheeseburger. Hopefully you can tell what all of those are. To be honest, I started looking at the details so much when I was drawing, they didn't even look like what I was drawing anymore. Especially the pancakes, I feel like you can't tell what those are, but hopefully you can. Um, but yeah, I had a lot of fun with this and I'm really, really happy with how this came out. I think that it looks really cool. And then we have the colorless page, which I really love this page also. I didn't really love doing it, to be honest. And not because of the black and white thing, but because I hate drawing fur. It's so tedious. 
you know, it turned out pretty good. I'm happy with it. My fur drawing skills aren't great. I'm not that good at it, obviously, but considering I don't really like to do it and I avoid it all the time, it's not bad. And I'm pretty happy with it. I think it's very cute, at least. So yeah, I just drew two pandas, I guess a mama panda and a baby panda, and the mama panda is like sleeping and the baby's just kind of over her, hanging on her like that. I, mm, I actually like this page a lot, but um, yeah, I'm glad that I did it and that it's over with, but that fur, man. And then the final page, the timed decoration page, it's so light and like delicate looking and plain compared to like all my other pages like you turn the page and it's like boom and then it's like ooh, what happened <laughs> um but i just didn't have time to like darken the colors and spend a lot of time on detail i decided to do a snowscape because i figured i could do that relatively quickly since snow is white so all i have to do is just put some little gray shadows in there and it looks like snow kind of um and then I did like a kind of multicolored sky, like a sunset sky um, with some soft pastels because you can cover a lot of ground with soft pastels quickly. And then I drew a tree and that was it. I was out of time, so I had to stop. I was actually surprised at how short of a time 10 minutes was. Like, I knew it was a short amount of time, but that was really short. Like, I did nothing <laughs> on this page. Okay, so that is it for today. I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode. And just in case you're losing faith in me because I have neglected YouTube for a while, don't worry, I will always come back. I am not going to just leave this series hanging. This is my book. I'm not gonna like just end the series without saying anything or just like never finish it. I'm going to finish it. Um, I still have quite a few pages in here. This book has like, 30 more pages than Wreck This Journal or something. So it's gonna take a long time to finish this book, but I will, so have no fear. And my upcoming semester, I am taking a break from school. I'm only taking two classes because I am so burned out from school and I just can't, can't do it anymore. And hopefully that will give me enough time to stick with YouTube through the semester and not just neglect my channel for five months because of school so you guys probably don't care about all that but there it is so see you next time for either this is not a book or a squishy update whichever one i finish first probably this is not a book but we will see okay bye guys <laughs>